What is going on guys, it's Declan here and today I'm going to be showing you guys a brand new card duplication glitch in Grand Theft Auto Online. So this glitch isn't as good as the previous card duplication glitches as you can't do this with supercars but you can do this with loads of other cars like Trevor's Blazer, maybe even Franklin's Buffalo and any other cars that aren't actually supercars. So I actually found this out by a guy called Sir Weed, I'll leave a link to his channel in the description below, make sure you guys check him out, he also creates GTA 5 content like my Myself. Nevertheless guys, I now know how to duplicate supercars, so I will be getting that video out to you guys very shortly, either later today or tomorrow, and it's actually using a previous method. So if you guys want that, make sure you drop a like down below, and also if you do go on to enjoy the video, let's see if we can shoot for something well over 500 likes, that would be awesome. And with that said, let's begin. So, starting off this card duplication glitch, you do need a friend to actually get this to work. Now I am going to be showing you guys from two different perspectives here in this video, so try to follow me closely here guys. Now the person standing outside the garage needs to place two sticky bombs on the garage door like you just saw. So as you can see right now, I have two sticky bombs placed on the garage door, and then the other person inside of the garage who is duplicating the vehicle needs to drive the vehicle that you want to be duplicated outside of his garage. Now as soon as you see him driving out of his garage, you want to blow up the sticky bombs so his vehicle gets destroyed. And as soon as the vehicle gets destroyed on his screen, he needs to go to the dashboard as quick as he can. Now I am going to be showing you guys from his perspective very shortly. But as you can see, if done correctly and if he has dashboarded quick enough, the vehicle will respawn on the side of the road and you can now drive this vehicle into your garage as normal so it's basically a way to pretty much copy your friend's vehicle and create a duplicate version of this and as you can see you can drive this into your garage normally now because I did have police on me I couldn't drive it in the first time so as soon as I lost the police I can drive this vehicle into my garage as normal. So this glitch does work, it is definitely a great car duplication glitch for non supercars. Like I said guys, I will be showing you guys a duplication glitch that works perfectly fine on supercars either later today or tomorrow, so make sure you guys leave a like if you want to see that very shortly. Anyway, as you can see I now own Trevor's Blazer in my garage, my friend basically copied this vehicle for me and when he simply comes back onto the game he will have the vehicle also. He may need to call Moore's Mutual Insurance but I'm pretty sure he doesn't. Nevertheless, as you can now see, I do own Trevor's Blazer and your friend can keep repeating this over and over again to keep giving you vehicles like this. Anyway guys, I am now going to be showing you from a different perspective. So, from the other player's perspective, or if you're going to be duplicating a vehicle for a friend, what you want to do is get in the vehicle that you are going to be duplicating. Then what you want to do is have your friend place two sticky bombs at the centre of your garage door, and once he has done that, drive outside of your garage, then press the Xbox guide button and then press Y and it will say this will end your current session. If you're playing a game, you will lose any unsafe progress. Are you sure you want to exit? Now hover over yes until you see that your vehicle has blown up just outside as you can see right now. You can see the explosion, press yes as quick as you can as soon as you see the explosion of your vehicle being blown up. And if done correctly and if you've done it quick enough, it will spawn directly behind your friend and then your friend can simply drive the vehicle into his garage exactly like you guys saw me do at the very start of the video. So that is pretty much how you do it guys, this does work on the PlayStation, it will work the same way. All you need to do is go to the PlayStation home as soon as you see the explosion from the sticky bombs detonating. I'm going to be showing you guys that once again, so if you are going to be duplicating a vehicle for a friend, you want to have your friend place two sticky bombs in the center of the garage like you saw at the start of the video. Then what you want to do is get on the vehicle that you are going to be duplicating, then drive it outside of your garage. Now whilst you are driving it out, you want to go to the Xbox guide button, and as soon as your friend detonates these sticky bombs as he sees you coming out, you want to go to the dashboard as quick as you can. And if done correctly, the vehicle will spawn behind your friend or beside him, and then he can simply get inside of the vehicle or on the vehicle, and then he can simply drive that into his garage. Now if it wasn't done correctly then your friend will not be able to enter the vehicle and you will have to do the glitch again but if you do it quick enough then it should be fine and your friend should be able to get on the vehicle. Anyway guys I'm going to leave the commentary there, hopefully I did explain things well enough, if I didn't be sure to drop a comment down below and I will be sure to try to help you out if you are having any problems and like I said I will be sure to try to get that new duplication glitch out to you guys or the old one actually sorry very shortly either today or tomorrow and it does work with supercars so make sure you guys leave a like if you want to see that very soon and with that said i shall see you all in the next video